Hey, it's Danny Roth here at the con talking to Ben Edlin about The Tick season Hello. two. Two, yes. So that's, indeed. I mean, is it exciting and new to be able to say like a live action Tick is That's an unprecedented going? statement, yes. We, uh, yeah, we broke through the season one barrier. Um, <laughs> yeah, that's uh, amazing. I mean, like we are very happy that we were able to continue those stories and kind of build another season out of it. Um, the response has been really good. I mean, this has been such a weird cultural experiment, the four iterations of The Tick through time. So to have a second season for this live action um, version is uh, just very exciting and cool. Are there characters that you want to bring in from the past that have not shown up? Are there ones that you've already thought about, ones that you know are going to come back, ones that you feel like you don't know if you could ever there, I will tease that we are bringing we are we are bringing into our universe a character from the co that started in the comic books and was evident in the cartoon and will be seen, but I won't say who it is. We always want to bring those characters into our uh, world. Um, what's always been the case too, though, is when you open up a new version of the Tick, it kind of first popular populates itself with ideas from the moment. So like. Um, last season we kind of immediately overkill just kind of announced his presence like he needed to be in that show so that comes from all of these like very gun heavy very kind of like gritty realistic things you know there's things from our time seem to influence the characters that sort of want to populate it and then there are these commemorative moments from other iterations of the tick I want to I want to get to those too how do you feel about the costume? Do you feel like they finally got it and now we don't need to do any more tick costumes now and forever? I feel like we really have achieved something great with the costume. And that was something that is like, has been a, a kind of a struggle throughout. Um, and what's interesting is that the different iterations of that costume figure both into our mythology of making the show and actually kind of feel like they are part of the show. Because in the beginning of the new season, um, you know, we never, let the changes in costume go unremarked upon. So that to me is part of what's become very interesting in our reality, but the new costume is almost what I used to draw, like really very much in terms of the body mass and the feeling of uh, power and just size and fluidity, it's, it's great.